Hi, everybody. Welcome to Pittsburgh. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Well, no pressure, but win or go home here, Ray. Yeah, you got to get the job done. You're in a bad spot. You trail the series, and you've got to get one on the board. A sight every hockey fan can appreciate. It's a clean sheet of ice, and we are about to get underway. The quest for Lord Stanley's mug continues right here tonight, and we are underway. Pittsburgh's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Gets in front of it. Good stop for Carter Hardy. Won the gold medal with Canada's World Junior Team in 2018. Been the goaltender the Flyers have been looking for for a long time. Scores on the rebound. He pops it. up this rebound makes no mistake once the goalie leaves the puck in front of the net the goalie's at your mercy and he does not miss the flyers make their way back to center what's the conversation here i don't know that there's any real great conversation to be had except you've got the early lead on the road it couldn't start any better than this scored by number 93 Jakub Voracek, assisted by number Hayes plays it against the boards. And by number 28. Centering pass. Voracek's dangerous, and he's got the puck now. He had the go-ahead goal earlier on. Quick pass over to Braun. Back at the point, they set it up. Moves it quickly over to Braun. Oh, a clutch save. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Pittsburgh's got it across the line. On their heels, trying to clear. And no luck with that one. Here's a chance, and he misses. That's a good scoring opportunity. He doesn't capitalize. Scores! That's back-to-back, -back, Ray. Well, it, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Philadelphia's been the better team to this point, and the stats show it. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck off the draw. by number 28. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Shoots it, misses high. Not a bad shot. He just tried to make it too perfect and shoots it over the crossbar. Grabbed along the board by Couturier. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Finds some space in the corner. Quick pass to Niskanen. Here's a blast. It comes up empty. Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Quick feed to Galchenyuk. The Penguins played along the wing. Move to the middle, and a stick in the lane ends that threat. Carries the puck up through center. Couturier's got the puck. And he regains control of the puck. Takes a shot. Oh, that just goes wide. Puck scooped up by Pedersen. Carries it across the line. And it's a quick pass to Pedersen. And that banks off a stick. Break away. Oh, and he can't finish. Looked like he wasn't sure whether he was going to deke or shoot. That chance is turned aside. I think he's still confused about what he was thinking there. Stopped by the goaltender. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Tanev's got it along the wing. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Off the left wing and into center. Over the line they come. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. Tanev's got it in the offensive zone. Here he is in front. Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Goalie 
Bailey just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Cut that lead to one as they get back to center ice. They must look at this game completely different, James. They should, because now with just half of this first period left, there's lots of time. You only trail by one. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Gets the puck back onto a stick. Sends it in deep. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Right in the slot, denies it in front. Philadelphia has capitalized on their offensive abilities here in this first period. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Takes it across the blue line. Here's a shot. Comes up with a stop. The Penguins look to start the transition game. Moves it around along the half wall. With the stop. Take it along the wall by Gensel. Here's a short pass to Crosby. And that one's blocked. Denied by the goaltender. Moves it to Crosby. Save made by the goalie. Nice work in there. After the first stop, he's got to find the puck to save the second. Along the half wall with the puck. Lets it fly and makes the save. The Flyers lead it here late this first period. Hayes wins it in the offensive zone. Moves the puck. Handles it along the blue line. Let's it go. Too much traffic in the lane. Latang's moving it ahead. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Latang's taking it from his own end. Sends a pass over. Throws it in. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Steps in front of that one. Backhander blocked in traffic. And with just seconds to spare, they get a goal here to close things out. You gotta look at it from both ways. That's a real kick in the pants for the team that gave up the goal. But what a boost of energy for them to score this late in the period. Now, this has been a pretty big mountain they've had to climb here, and they work all the way back to complete the comeback. Lawton's won it. Moves the puck over to Van Riemsdyk. And there's the save. 2-2 is where we stand as the first period comes to an end. teams get a breather so will we we'll take a quick pause for the cause welcome back everyone he's ray i'm james second period set to go tied up here as we get underway here in period number two. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Pittsburgh's focus has to be getting more pucks to the net. They really didn't do much in that first period. 
James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Crosby's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Comes up with the stick save. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Let's it go wide. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Blown opportunity. Oh, he put it wide. You don't get many of these a night. And when it's your turn, you got to be ready to get it on the net. He misses here. Here's a shot. Misses a golden opportunity there. Getzel's going to play the puck behind the cage. Stopped by the goaltender. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Moves it quickly over to Dumoulin. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Moves the puck along the half wall. Just wide. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. McCann's got it across the line. Right off the side of the net. The Flyers gain possession in their own end. Puts it on net. Oh, and he had the whole corner. As the goalies have gotten better and better, you have to deliver it quick. Sometimes you just miss. Shot denied by the goaltender. Well positioned save, and he has the rebound over in the corner. Lindblom's got the puck near the back end. Let's it fly. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Under all sorts of pressure in his own end with the puck now. Carries it in. Into the corner of the attacking area. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Puts it on net. That's wide of the net. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. He scores! Well, this could be something that changes your year around. You get a few bounces like this, or you don't get a few bounces like this. The puck's off the post in the net. Well, this took a little bit of a detour and hit the post, but, man, was this quick. Off the pipe and in. Giving themselves control of this game now with a one goal lead in the second. They'd like to get another before they go in for the second intermission. You'd love at least a couple goal lead going into period three. Schultz has the puck against the half wall. Gives up the body for the block. Van Riemsdyk's got the puck in his own zone and makes the save. Puts one on that. There's another stop. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Penguins are looking to build on this one goal lead. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Pedersen's gonna play it against the half wall. Here's an opportunity, and that one's stopped. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Hortquist got it along the boards. Quick pass to Cajon. Puck picked up by Voracek. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. And now he moves it quickly to Giroux. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Crosby's carrying it ahead. Looks to set up at the point now. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Unleashes a cannon! That's a beautiful pass saved by the goalie there. More than half the period has expired. 3-2 is where we sit in what has been a tightly contested affair. Taken by Pedersen. Quick feed to Schultz. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Pittsburgh's ready to go on the attack. Here's a short pass to Gensel. From the point, he scores! The captain leading by...
Oh, he could really shoot the puck, and he had enough time to tee that one up. He blows it right past the goaltender from the point. Pittsburgh's now gone up by a pair in the second. So they've got a two-goal lead. Some people say it's the worst lead in hockey. Well, guess what? I'll take the worst lead as opposed to trailing by two. Yeah, you know what's better than down by two? Being up by two, right? Of course Simple. Here's a shot, and that one's turned away. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Philadelphia's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Through center along the wing. With possession along the wall. Wrists one, stopped by the goaltender. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Penguins have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Let's it go, shuts them down. Rust's got it against the boards. Picked up along the boards by Rust. Winds up, lets it go, way off target. Probably better off to take a little off the shot and get it on target. He's nowhere near the net. And that's broken up. Here's a chance, fires the wrist shot. Oh, what a chance. Oh, James, he tried to get rid of that in a hurry. He just misses. Here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end. We get a whistle, and they'll do it all over at the other end. Yeah, of course, the team that iced the puck isn't able to change players. A rule put in a couple of seasons ago. Pittsburgh's been the better team tonight, and they lead as a result late in the second. Lawton's won the draw. Takes a shot, comes up with the stop. Moves with the puck at the corner. Here's a shot, and that goes off the iron and stays out. Philadelphia is still going to have to grind away here. They trail, and they're looking for something to go their way. That didn't help. Knocked away. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Here's a shot. Makes the save. Like that save as he was able to deflect it to the corner. Takes a shot, and he comes up with it. Moves it to Braun. And he makes the save. And that's all she wrote on period number two in this one. 4-2 is where we sit after 40 minutes of play. Tonight is our team poster giveaway. If you find a sticker on the inside cover of your program, go to guest services. To What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? Pittsburgh's ahead in this high-chance, high-danger game. No use changing the way you're going to play now. That's off a stick. Simone swooping in on the attack. Here's a blast! Denies him on the play! Hart's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Lots of time left in this period. It's a two-goal lead here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Scooped up along the wall by Provorov. And now it's grabbed by Braun. Braun's got it in the defensive end. Takes the feed at the point. Moves it quickly over to Hayes. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Pittsburgh's outplayed the opposition tonight, particularly offensively, as they lead it early in this third period. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Here they come on the attack.
Quick pass to Simone. Whoa. It's in the back of the net. He scores! That's a really good shot. The goaltender's down in the butterfly. He thinks he's got mostly everything covered, but apparently not. The puck gets by him. there tonight but Ray I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench yeah half the guys out here are having fun the other half this game can't end quick enough receives the pass on the attack along the boards handles the puck with the stop puck grab by Hayes the Penguins ready to go on the attack moves around along the half wall right to the middle from in close fantastic save Punk right on top of that chance. Great A spot, great A save. Hayes setting up against the wall. Braun's got the puck. Back to the blue line. Takes the feed, makes the save. Picked up along the wall by Hayes. Quick feed to Konechny. Takes the feed at the back end. Move to the middle. Here he is from the slot. Oh, what a save in front. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. And he slides it quickly to Tanev. Picked off in the open ice. Man, they've worked the puck around so well on this shift. They've totally worn out the defending team. About two things are going to happen here, it seems like. They're going to either take a penalty or they're going to give up a goal. This is a great shift. Along the half wall with the puck. Takes a shot. That goes wide. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Bar out! Grabbed along the boards by Braun. Here's a short pass to Tanev. Looks to set up along the point. And here's a shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Picking up some steam at center ice. Moves the puck along the half wall. Let's it fly! And he says no! Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Hornquist's got it into offensive territory. Philadelphia's regained possession of the puck. Snaps it on net, and that goes wide. He scores! Sean Couturier, his teammates call him the answer. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. Philadelphia's narrowed the gap here in the third, but still a long way to go, Red. Yeah, James, this is still way down the road to even this game up. But if you get one... Maybe you get another. Maybe they get nervous. Score by number 14. Konechny's got it in the offensive end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Makes the save as that goes off the glove. Well past the midway mark of this period, the Flyers are trying to get back into this one as they still trail by two goals. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Here's a blast! Comes up with the glove save! And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Carries it across the line. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Just wide of the net. Moves the puck behind the net. Oh, what an effort giving up the body there. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. With possession along the wall. Back to the point it goes. With some momentum driving towards the net. And not much on that one. Sends the pass over. Takes the pass. Misses the net. 
you're going to go back and kick yourself for that one because he wants that on the net. He doesn't miss it by much. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Couturier's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Moves it to Niskanen. Here's a blast, and that's blocked away. Up along the wing. Unleashes a cannon. Air mails it. Did he ever? He's got to bring that down a couple of feet. Here's a chance in front. Stick save from the goaltender. On the attack along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Puck scooped up by Niskanen. Over the line they come. Takes a shot. Just wide. The Flyers have had every bit the amount of chances their opponents had. But here late in the third, they can only rue what's gone wrong. Here in the dying moments of this period, up to eight goals scored so far tonight. It's 5-3. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Inside of the final minute here in the third. Fires it down the ice. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Takes it across the blue line. Nice pass. Wide of the net. Philadelphia is so disappointed in the way that they played in the offensive zone. They've generated a lot, just not been able to finish. If they come up short, they only have to look at the game film and see the missed opportunities. All alone! Oh! Clutch stop on the breakaway. If you're ahead, the clock never moves. If you're breakaway with an empty net. Wow. And there's the insurance marker much needed for them on this night. It's amazing how many times a guy misses an empty net. But this one he puts between the pipes. They'd really have to screw this up now, James, to lose. The empty netter should put it away. Won the draw. Puck picked up by Hag. Van Riemsdyk's got it along the wing. Close save. How did he get a piece of that? 15 minutes, 43 seconds. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And we are all over with this one. Well, on the heels of that one, Ray, it's the only time you ever use the word stave. They stave off elimination now. They do. I mean, looked like they were pretty much finished down 3-0. But they showed some metal here, some character as they came off the mat to get themselves a game in this series. My name is James Sabalski, and on behalf of Ray Ferraro, thanks so much for hanging out with us. What an intense evening from this playoff atmosphere.